Yo, what's happening, my people? So it's your boy Chance Jollibet, aka Smooth, back with another video. So today, this is a super special unboxing, super special shoe review. This right here is gonna be the shoe of 2022. Like, mark y'all calendars, everything. People will lose their mind whenever this shoe finally drops. We're seeing a lot of more, a lot of images about this and stuff. But let me get my first little. <laughs> little view out on my YouTube channel. So, see what it is. I'm probably, I know I've showed it in the description. You know what this is, so let me not be coy about it. Check out. Check out the sizing tags and all that. Read it, read it, read it. 1985 Air Jordan 1. Ew. Let's get it. So, First thing right here, uh, see that? So that's that's who who uh these are brought by. Appreciate you. Thank y'all. Thank y'all for sending this my way. Got the white paper and stuff. And cue up the song, man. Cue up the song every time I drop something. You know, you know what it is. Uh. New shoes, new shoes. <laughs> Boy, Nike makes some good shoes. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Hey, hey. These right here. These right here? Yo. These things are stupid. Yo, I've seen a lot of videos and seen different people at sneaker events and all this with these or whatnot. But dog, in hand, yo, these stupid, these stupid, get that 360 out the way, god, yo, yo, these, yo, these, these crazy, these crazy, check that out, this one right here, it got, I wonder if they, they gonna come with this, I'm not sure if they gonna come with the black and the red shoelaces. The black lace might be. The black lace might be all right. <laughs> Maybe on the on foot, I might put a black shoelace and put a white shoelace. Shit, we're gonna, we gonna have to see. Uh, but I'm not gonna like mix it up. Like when if I wear these or whatever, I'm not gonna have like I'm gonna have either a white shoelace or a black shoelace. It's not gonna be both shoelaces on this. No, you don't do that with the with the Shard Towns. But Let's get into it, man. So, we know what they're doing this year with the Jordan 1s, man, with a lot of them. They're doing that, like, semi, like, cracked material. They're trying to make it look vintage, make it look old and stuff. That crack, yo, that is nice. That is nice, and that's, like, on the white part. They got it also on the toe area. That is nice, man. I like that. I like it a lot. The red is just... Just that plain flat leather, uh, the plain flat pleather and stuff. You you know how how they be liking to do nowadays. They don't give us that old vintage leather leather like they did back in the days. Got that the jump the Nike tag, Nike Nike tag, Nike sign, whatever Nike check, the Nike check on the side. And it's nothing special. It's nothing special with it. It doesn't have any cracks or. It's a special material or anything. It's like a what, like a rubberish type material. This is something that everybody wants to know about. The ankle collar area. You got that crack. That's that, that very vintage look to it. Noise, noise, noise. Also, check out the Wings logo. See how it is on here. So trying to give you the best looks possible be footage you know I'm gonna do that as well and all that the sale look of it like it isn't like a, a like yellowish like a very old looking sale but it's you can tell it's not like a, a bright white a bright white so that's very nice man trying to see trying to see let me let me see the back is the back is pretty nice, man. Like, it's, it's kind of an hourglassy. It's not like a bulky and just a 
It's not like bulky and just straight down. Like it has a little bit of curves to it. She been in the gym getting sexy. She went to the DR, got her body done. Listen, something. Like the only thing like the packaging, I don't know if that's gonna be the packaging whenever these like officially drop. And like the toe area, I don't know exactly, but like from pictures, like the, the toe area looks like old, like the old vintage, like very sleek. So I don't know if this is exactly how it's gonna be, but it does have a nice curve to it. Cause some some jaw ones, man, like I said, and I done seen some bezel out like that and come in that looks bad. So got a, a nice little curvature, but I think it might be like a little more slick, like whenever these these drop. But also, that soul, man. That soul very vintage. People, you can't really see the soul or anything. So, but uh, but that's nice, nice little hint. And also, the tongue. I ain't talking about the tongue. It's kind of like a, a pinkish hue. That's what I get. It's not. It's not a white. It's not like a sail. It's kind of like a white that had like a little bit of red, and they washed it. And like the, the red rubbed off like just a little little bit. So that's how, how that's looking. See Nike Air at the top right there. Yo, these right. Sneaker sneaker of the year. Sneaker of the year. And I'm about to say something. I, I don't know if this will be blasphemous or not. These are shitting on the trophy rooms. These are 20 times better than the trophy rooms, man. I, I really thought trophy rooms was trash. I know they probably going for a grip. I think these gonna go for a grip, but I think at the end of the day, trophy room is probably gonna be worth more than what these will be because they they are more rare. But these are way better than trophy rooms to me. Trophy rooms trash. I don't like trophy rooms. But <laughs> but yo, very dope, man. Shout out to them for sending sending this out, man. Uh, put their Twitter the Twitter information and stuff in the uh. In the bio, in the description, whatever. You know, y'all want to write them, y'all want to do what y'all got to do, whatever. Hey, but these are stupid. On foot coming. On foot coming in a minute, man. Let's get it. Peace.